Cholesterol, a waxy substance found in your blood, plays a pivotal role in helping build healthy cells. However, a high cholesterol level can lead to heart disease, particularly for those living with diabetes. Research suggests that individuals with diabetes are more likely to have unhealthy cholesterol levels, which can increase the risk of heart disease. But don't worry, there are effective strategies that can help control cholesterol levels, and we'll explore them together in this video, backed up by scientific studies. But before we continue, if you appreciate all the information and the research that goes into making a video like this, it does help out tremendously if you hit the like button or hit subscribe. Thank you, and let's begin! Did you know that your dietary habits significantly impact your cholesterol levels? A study published in the Journal of Nutrition in 2015 underlined the role of dietary fiber in reducing cholesterol levels. The study found that individuals who consumed more dietary fiber had lower total and LDL cholesterol levels. Foods like oats, barley, beans, lentils, Fruits and vegetables are rich in dietary fiber and should be a part of your daily diet. However, it's not just about what you should eat, but also about what you should avoid. Saturated fats and trans fats are the primary culprits in raising cholesterol levels. The American Heart Association suggests replacing these fats with healthier fats like those found in avocados, olive oil, and fatty fish. A study published in the New England Journal of Medicine in 2013 demonstrated that a Mediterranean diet rich in these healthy fats significantly reduces the risk of cardiovascular diseases. Physical activity is another key player in controlling cholesterol levels. The Diabetes Prevention Program study published in the New England Journal of Medicine in 2002 found that moderate intensity exercise, like brisk walking for 150 minutes per week, could significantly lower cholesterol levels in people with prediabetes. Regular physical activity also helps control weight and reduce blood sugar levels, which is a boon for people with diabetes. Smoking is a risk factor for high cholesterol and diabetes-related complications. A study published in the Journal of the American Medical Association in 2015 revealed that smoking cessation significantly improved HDL cholesterol levels and overall cardiovascular health. So if you're a smoker, it's high time to consider quitting. Medication can also be a valuable tool in the fight against high cholesterol. Satins are commonly prescribed to people with diabetes to help lower cholesterol levels. A landmark study published in The Lancet in 2016 found that satin therapy reduces the risk of major vascular events like heart attacks and strokes in people with diabetes. Regular checkups and monitoring your cholesterol levels are essential. High cholesterol typically doesn't have any symptoms, which is why it's often called a silent disease. Regular testing allows your healthcare provider to monitor your cholesterol levels and adjust your treatment plan as needed. If you've been diligently following a healthy diet, getting plenty of exercises, and taking your medication as prescribed, but your cholesterol levels remain high, don't lose heart. Genetics can also influence cholesterol levels, and in such cases, it may be more difficult to control. The important thing is to keep up with your healthy lifestyle habits and continue working with your healthcare provider to manage your cholesterol. Now, let's talk about the number one tip for controlling cholesterol levels in people with diabetes. It's not a magic pill or a secret food, it's consistency. All of the strategies mentioned are effective, but they require consistency. Making long-term changes to your diet, engaging in regular physical activity, quitting smoking, taking your medication regularly, and going for regular checkups are all lifelong commitments. A study published in the Journal of the American College of Cardiology in 2014 found that people who consistently adhered to a healthy lifestyle had a lower risk of cardiovascular disease and lower cholesterol levels. So the secret sauce, the number one tip, is consistency. It's essential to remember that everyone is unique, and what works for one person might not work for another. That's why working with your healthcare provider to develop a personalized plan is so important. Your plan should be something that fits into your lifestyle and is sustainable over the long term. A study in the Journal of Diabetes and Its Complications in 2021 emphasized the importance of personalized care in diabetes management. It found that when healthcare providers offered treatment plans tailored to each person's lifestyle, health status, and preferences, their patients were more likely to manage their cholesterol levels effectively. 
Lastly, while the focus is on lowering cholesterol levels, remember that managing diabetes and overall health is a comprehensive approach. It's not just about diet or just about exercise. It's about incorporating a balanced diet, regular physical activity, medication if prescribed, regular monitoring, and smoking cessation into your daily routine. The key is to make these changes a part of your lifestyle. The Diabetes Control and Complications trial published in the New England Journal of Medicine in 1993 found that people with diabetes who adopted a comprehensive approach to managing their condition had better health outcomes and a lower risk of complications. In conclusion, managing cholesterol levels in people with diabetes involves a combination of lifestyle modifications like adopting a heart-healthy diet, regular physical activity, smoking cessation, regular monitoring, and medication if prescribed. But the secret to effectively implementing these strategies is consistency. And remember, this isn't a solo journey. You're not alone in this. Your healthcare provider is your partner in this journey, and they can help you devise a plan that's tailor-made for you. Controlling cholesterol levels might seem like a daunting task, but with knowledge, effort, and the right strategies, it's an achievable goal. It's all about making small changes and sticking to them constantly. So, take that first step today and embark on your journey to a healthier you. Thank you for watching.